Center's 525-21. Happy Tuesday. Good morning. Hope everybody had a great trade day yesterday. Let's do it again today. Here's the game plan. We're going to go through ES on multiple time frames as usual. Then we'll check out maybe just a couple names here in VIX. Um, so before we do that, go down the bottom right hand corner, hit that Option Center logo and subscribe. Um, also, we are in the Option Guys Discord. It's a free Discord all day long for traders. Good stuff there. Um, we have tons of fun, uh, lots of nights, nice uh, collaboration. So check it out. It's in the uh, description. The link is below. Okay, here we go. ES on the monthly. We are pushing uh, with divergence on the RSI. Wave five of five. You check out that candle. We're finally getting into like a, we're pushing. We have a body on that candle now. Uh, maybe some sort of hangman um candle or whatnot but we really need to get over that 42 11 and stay that's the range of last month and just stay over that that would um be a good indication we stay over that and then start off the new month uh over that level and continue to push up if we can okay on the weekly weekly we also have a divergence on that rsi really going there and we're trying to trying to curl over the macd so we got to be careful there we're not out of the woods yet um you know we haven't crossed yet but uh we we are back testing this trend line here um we're holding that eight ma so we're we're uh you know bullish until proven guilty um we're pushing we we have this inside week and we're pushing a uh inside week up so that's a good thing for the bulls let's see if we can hold that into next week on the daily daily a trend is my friend our friend <laughs> all right so we're working on wave one two three four and either that's a wave four and we're pushing up one, two, wave three. Or this is also a, a perfect chance for uh, this to be a one and then a two. Because this could be an ABC correction. Uh, we'll see. We're back testing this trend line. Um, we'll have to. Either way, we're going to have to. Um, we're going to have to have a pullback. And that pullback will determine that either wave four or we'll, we'll be headed you know down for a wave three so either this is a one two three we get a pullback four and then five um which you know that's that's very bullish and we continue from there or so one two or a b c and then we really start pushing down all right so we're just going to keep our eyes open for that we're we're bullish um we're trying to uh uh, cross over the MACD. We're bullish until proven otherwise on there. Uh, we're over the 8MA and it's crossing back over the, the 20, kind of repairing itself. We want to push out of this range here. Remember, we've been in this sideways trade for some time now and we just really want to, you know, um, this is not quite, you know, really the top of it, but this gives us a good area to put our back against when trading and then uh, see if we can break through that um, back trend or the uh, back test here get back over that trend line there all right let's go down to the 65 minute 65 minute candle and really dig down here see what's happening we had our abc correction this is a possible one two and now on a um minute level we have one two three four looks like a, a ending diagonal five and then possibly quick wave two really shallow which is really bullish on wave three and then working our way up to a one two three four and it's possible five and here sometime too soon uh you know this this may be in a, a very bullish stance this might be a one two one two that would get going but until we're just going to hold this trend line here and uh and, and, and you know we, we can't get a perfect count um, it just looks really bullish. We just want to, if we hold this trend line, it doesn't matter what the count is. So, so keep, keep riding the trend, my friend. Um, and let's see, let's go over, let's check out the VIX real quick. 
VIX pre-market still in an elevated level. So, you know, it, I just really feel like we're, we're not out of the woods. I'm, I, I started to get a count there. I'm not going to count this, but we're we're really pulling back from this uh, this big spike we had there. Maybe we're starting to um, triangulate. Actually, let's use a different board. Yeah, so we're... If we go to the daily, you know, we're still in this... Uh, falling wedge and this is a possible we had abc correction up maybe we're going abc down uh and then we we might spike up after that so let's let's just keep an eye on the vix as long as we're in this area treading down we're gonna be we're gonna be bullish on the um s p on the market you know nothing to really worry about when the vix is going down but it, it, it's not going to go down forever folks and let's see what facebook is doing Facebook pre-market. All right, just kind of gapping up a little bit. You know, uh, Facebook's really been launching. We're on wave three, possibly, if not at ABC. So just uh, very impulsive, looking good. Microsoft. Same thing. Tesla. Tesla had a nice move there, pull back and just a, a smaller move here. So this might be a one, two, one, two headed up there. If this isn't just a, a small correction. Uh, what else do we want to look at? NVIDIA. I hate looking at this one because I missed that whole trip. I was trying to push up there. I tried to push up here, got a little bit of the move. And then finally, this one is... <laughs> Just missed it. Totally missed it. Wasn't going to chase it. And then it just keeps going. Oh, goodbye, NVIDIA. No, no pullbacks. And let's check out one more square since we're jumping into that one. So we're getting a little bit of follow through on square. Um, let's see if we can get up to this uh 2020 range looks like a little bit of resistance at that point and uh, see where we go from there. So uh, let me get a good look at the, uh, yeah, we should get some follow through today. And this 20 uh, MA also appears to be right with that 2020 area. And then we have a little bit of work to do. If this just isn't a bounce, um, I, I think Square potentially could uh, actually get to all-time highs after going sideways for some time and consolidating the move and heading to higher levels to all-time highs so we'll keep an eye on that each and every day so hit that notification button thanks for joining us here at option center good luck trading today we'll see you in the discord